follow your heart's instincts. It's not just the pumping station, but it also guides us through feelings. Feelings versus thoughts, mind versus heart. Mentally aware on one side, and on the other side, awareness with feelings. Logically, we are all capable. Heart-wise also, we are all capable. So when things are happening naturally, heart doesn't give you any signal. But the moment something goes wrong, heart will speak louder. It's as simple as that. Remember, you know, when you wanted five dollars from your father's wallet, and you stick to dad, I want five dollars, you know, and he doesn't give you. And then you dare to take it from his wallet, your heart becomes heavier. Whenever you are going to do anything absurd, wrong, the heart will run heavier, it will beat faster. There is a bit, there is a physiological response as, as well. You know, develop some sort of fear. If someone asks you a question, what's your name? And you say, I'm Jerome. But you're Alex. That's when your heart will say, oh, why are you saying Jerome? You're Alex. So anything natural, heart doesn't give signal. Your heart will tell you, don't speak a lie. A small voice inside you will make you feel, don't do this. So when fear is there, don't do it. Fear is another sign that you are on a wrong track. And if you are going to perpetrate in the same direction, follow your fears and do something crazy, that in itself will create more fear. So one has to see and analyze your heart status. Is it beating faster? Is it heavier? Does it keep reminding me that, think over this again? And this is what I call eclipse of conscience. Where eclipsing your mind's logic with the feelings of your heart, I think this eclipsing of both, juxtaposing and becoming one, is the ideal state. That what I'm thinking and what I'm feeling, they are both in one. More we listen to heart, clearer the voice will become. Later on, heart may not even give a signal of right and wrong because you have become that way. You have become wisdom personified where you don't have to worry about heart signal or mind signal. This is evolution to my mind, evolution of consciousness. But beauty would be when the mind also agrees with the heart. To understand this and appreciate the beauty of creating an eclipse of logic with the feeling, it is because of the meditation. Meditation sensitizes our being so much, our conscience so much. It refines our thinking, it refines our intellect, it refines my being, and it makes me so wiser in the process. We are making use of it to arrive at a higher level. This happens naturally when there is a right way of meditation is taught where you are able to go dive deeper into the recesses of your heart without any prejudice.